Okay, y'all. Your girl don't know what she looking like, but this is gonna be a get ready with me a bit of You and me will always be tight. Family every single day and night. Even when you stop acting like a fool, you know I'm loving every single thing. Yes, get over there. It's giving me very much who oh y'all can't even see because the nails done. I'm gonna have to oh you can see them back here. <laughs> nails done by May. Finally booked her, finally got my appointment. Y'all know it was supposed to be a back-to-back -back weekend of pampering and glow up. Hair done, nails done, feet done. Ho, oh, her nose pierced. I got a clap like this. Ooh. <laughs> anyway, how y'all doing, fam? <laughs> how y'all doing? Um, I just left from getting my nails done. Y'all, I got off work this morning. Oh, uh, and I've been up since one o'clock. Haha. -ha. Uh, well, really one thirty. One o'clock, one o'clock. Um, and I got dressed, took my brother to work, me and my mama and my aunt my adopted aunt because i adopted her as my auntie we all went to go get our pedicures and then i had a nail appointment at 5 30. um so i went to the and now i'm here to go get something to eat because i have not eaten since i've been awake and tomorrow ebony Myself and Jessica, we're going to a comedy show at Chuckles. We're going to see Daisy Banks. Um, I don't know if y'all follow him on Instagram. If not, you should on all platforms. Daisy Banks, he is hilarious. He's been here all weekend, and we were fortunate enough to snag some tickets. So we're going to do that Sunday. So I'm gonna be cute, cute tomorrow, y'all. I gotta figure. I still gotta figure out my outfit. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to do some jeans a top and some heels or a dress and some heels and a jacket i don't i don't know but i'm going to be cute so i'm probably look at it tonight um and figure out what i'm wear. it's it eight tomorrow but you know ladies y'all know you gotta be mentally like have the outfit in your head and i have to look to make sure i actually have the outfits like I want to have it. Plus, I need to wash clothes. Um, because yeah, it's time for me to wash clothes. Y'all know I be waiting <laughs> weeks and weeks to wash clothes until I start running underwear. I have not started running out of underwear, but I have put a dent in them, and I would like to go and wash them clothes. So I ain't got too much to worry about when it comes to uh. What was I finna say? When it comes to... I need to get the canteen off my seat before it leak again. When it comes to... Uh, uh, clothes. I mean, yeah. Underwear. Um, Because after this week, I probably will end up running out just a little bit. Okay. I need y'all to... Oh, we gotta stop by Brittany House too, y'all. Because I'm finally getting my uh, Christmas gift from her. So, we got to stop out there to get that. Because your girl needs it. She bought me some color, not color pop. Um, some, um, 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 um. Hold on. Crayon case. That's what it's called. It's it both on with a C and I couldn't think of it. So, I got to, when I get home... Hopefully, I remember to show y'all um, my little spreadsheet that I have created for myself as far as budgeting um, to help me budget better, like my money throughout the week. 
I really need to show y'all that it's really cool. Like, I was just sitting there and I was like, I gotta get tighter with my budgeting. Like, because that last paycheck, the way I blew that money, I was like, okay, I'm falling back into hard, to old habits and I don't want to do that. So, I created myself a spreadsheet that I am going to go home because I have to fill it out. It's based on bills and stuff, like how my bills, what I'm paying, when I'm paying them, when they do, how much I'm paying, the total I should be paying a month, the total, like as far as savings, I really don't have a cap on my savings or a minimum um, on my savings, but I do know how much I allow myself on each check based on it. Uh, So, yeah. But I'm finna get some food from Backyard Burger. Um, I'm gonna stop by Brit's house to get my long overdue Christmas gift. And she'll never see this because she don't really watch the channel like this. She'll be up to date. But it's long overdue. Um, and I'm gonna pick that up. And then I'm going to go home and eat. And I'm trying to decide if I want to get fries here or okay what they doing somebody behind me y'all this idiot here is backing up um it's moving and i guess they getting out the line because they don't have what they want or to wait too long but like why would you do that in the middle and you see cars that's the entrance for cars to come through stupid anyway um, I forgot what I said. Oh, I'm gonna show y'all my budget spreadsheet. Uh, I'm going to try to remember to do that. And it was something else I just told a job I was gonna show y'all. I forgot, I forgot. But yeah, so I will talk when I get my thoughts. Y'all, she did her thing. That's marble. She did her thing. Uh, how the kids be doing on TikTok? Hey, I'm gonna be so cute. Okay, anyway, I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay, y'all. So I'm back a lot sooner. Okay, I'm back a lot sooner. I went to Burger King. Burger King said they didn't have an impossible whopper. Cool. Okay, so I got out of line and. I went across, literally right next, literally right across to Wendy's. And I'm like, okay, well, I can get a chicken sandwich there. Because my whole thing was, if I'm going to buy something to eat, I'm going to eat something I don't have at the house. So I'm going to get an Impossible Whopper and just make fries at the house. Right? Well, that was the plan. So, you know, I get a girl my order. My order was a classic chicken sandwich combo with an high C to drink. I had texted Brittany and I said, hey, do you want anything? I'm at Wendy's. She said she wanted a chocolate chip cookie and some milk if they had it. Okay. I get to the window. The girl like, we ain't got no chocolate chip cookies. Okay, fine. Well, what kind of cookies y'all got? So they got sugar cookies. So I got the sugar cookie because I had already given her the money. I didn't feel like, you know, holding up the line, waiting for them to take it off and deduct it, refund and all this stuff. It wouldn't be easy. me. So, um end up doing it i get to the window to get my food why in the world i get a frosty <laughs> i got the milk but why did i get a frosty and i get my high seat drink granted i really didn't want the high seat but i was gonna get it because i'm like it's a meal and if i'm paying for it i'm gonna get something that i don't have at the house because y'all know i always get water so I was like, okay. So I'm sitting at the window. The girl gave me the cookie and she gave me the frosty. I'm still sitting at the window. She come back to the window. Are you waiting on something else? Are you deaf, dumb, and retarded? Like, I hate to say that about people. Like, you literally just sent my order back to me as soon as I pulled up to the window. And told me what I was getting. And I confirmed and said, yes, I am getting that. Why? Why is it so hard? I don't I don't understand. Like that'd be hard for me to comprehend. Like, and they not even busy. they they have a nice little, you know, pace going, but they aren't like swamped to the point where you will be mixing up orders. So my high seat, I'm literally looking at it in the window. And I was like, you know what? Forget it. 
She didn't give it to the next customer because she didn't give me any frosty. So it's an even trade. So now I'm going to McDonald's because I wanted some chocolate chip cookies too. So now I'm going to McDonald's to get some darn chocolate chip cookies because I've never had one of chocolate chip cookies. And apparently they cookies come cold. But this just like blew me. Because don't, don't repeat my order to me. As soon as I come to the window, you need just act, you need to just say, okay, is do you have the such, 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 such. And while I'm sitting there, don't look at me like I'm crazy for sitting there. Oh, no, McDonald's. <laughs> but some cookies. Oh, this line steep. Pour some cookies down. Am I going to do this for some cookies? I am. Um, But, yeah, like, don't don't do that. It kind of it ruffled my feathers because I was just like, and she was looking at me like, you still waiting on something? Like, why you still sitting here? Girl, run me my food. I'm starving. I ain't ate all day. So, I just got the classic. Um, and then you know it was supposed to come with the high seat because the shroud and the dog on back. But I'm going to eat that frosted though. I really kind of don't want to because I don't want to be bloated tomorrow. Mm -hmm. You might think about that. I'm probably going to eat that. Anyway. Y'all. I'm hurt. And yes, I sanitized my hand already. That's the first thing I do when I get in the car. Or after I get my food. Because I ain't ate nothing all day. All day. My last meal was at 2.30 this morning. So I'm hungry. Like, the cookie not even warm. Cookie's hard. But whatever. I guess Brittany, she can eat it. If she do, she do that. But I'm going to get some chocolate chip cookies from McDonald's because I know how, excuse me for smacking y'all, I'm hungry. I know how it is when you got your mouth set on something and you don't get it. So, and plus I want some chocolate chip cookies too. So, yeah. I'm just dumbfounded by the whole thing. Anyway. I hope I'll say something to y'all. I think that's what I came back for. So now we at McDonald's. Waiting on finna order cookies. And then um we're going to Brittany House. And then we're going home. Because I'm tired. I have not been asleep all day. Well, I slept to one. I went to sleep at like nine. And I slept to like one. Really, not even slept to one because my mom and them kept waking me up. So I slept to like 12 30. So, um, I'm tired. I'm tired. And since I've been up, I've been in the streets. Yeah. Me is tired. So, yeah. Very cool. I'll see y'all for the crib. If I don't vlog when I get home, y'all. Charge this to my head. Not my heart. Okay? Okay? Because 9 to 10, I'm going to get home and take a shower. Yeah, I know the rest. I'm going to try not to follow straight to sleep, though. So me and my mom supposed to watch a movie together. But yeah, it's 827, so. By the time I get back, she probably gonna want to sleep. She be acting old. So, yeah. Anyway. My nails are so pretty, y'all. There y'all go. Y'all can see them there. And I don't hold my fingers like they broke. This how Meg hold her fingers. Like they broke. <laughs> she gonna give me for saying it, but whatever. She gonna call her fingers like that. I'm glad I got some water in this car with me. 
we're just out of a date. My bad, y'all just watch me eat. Let me get out here. I'll see you at the house. Hey guys, as promised, here is my um, monthly breakdown of uh, what I have going on. So in the first column, you see it say bills. It say all the bills that I have to pay that I'm conscious of. Miscellaneous. Um, so I got my car payment insurance, health insurance, um, Discover Card, Hulu, BT Plus, Mastercard, Miscellaneous, and Spotify. Um, and then I have the amount that's due. So in that column is the amount of money that I pay for each uh, payment. Now with health insurance, that automatically comes out of my check, but I keep track of it. So if my check looking a little funny, I can go and backtrack and figure out why. Then I have when it's due. So in that column, I put the date is due. Um, I have the date paid, the amount actually, I actually paid. Because sometimes I like with your Discover bills, um, it may be sitting like $35 as the minimum payment, but I may decide that month to pay 200 So that's why I have an actual amount paid column. And then for the remaining balance, um, like if I know the remaining balance of my bill, then I go ahead and write it down in this column so I can see where I'm at and see how I can continue to work it down. Then down here, I just got the total amount that I'm expected to pay out. Now, if that number that I have up here told out to be more than this, then that means I'm spending more money than what I'm making, and that's not good. So now I can move my pen and stuff. Y'all, this be too close Spotify. Y'all can know that much. I had it covered up because I didn't want y'all to know how much I was paying, and y'all be in my pockets and stuff. But then down here um, for total income for the month, this is just so each so each sheet is for literally the month. So I get two checks in a month, get paid bi weekly. So that means. I put the first check plus the second check equals whatever the total amount is. And then for my savings, this savings is for these envelopes that I pull and I put um the amount that's on there. So like this one is 12 and I'll put $12 in there. And really most of the time I put more in there. Like if it's 12 and I only got 20 then I put the $20 in there. So that's what this savings is for. And then my bank, well, this line savings. And then my bank savings, that's what I put in my savings account that's actually with my bank. <sighs> oh, excuse me. Um, The only thing that I don't have on here is my tides. And I just write that down um, at the bottom so I know what else I have paid or I need to pay or I have paid. Um, Because... Believe it or not, you'll be like, dang, I'm short $100 and don't know what happened to it. But, like, literally, the way I have this set up is so I can keep track of every single dime. Not every single dime. Like, of course, $20, maybe $30 may get, you know, maybe, like, for food or something. And I just don't put it down. But that's why I also took cash out the bank so I can make sure. And I also documented how much cash I took out the bank. Um, So, that way, I can know that okay well you took this that's what this is for this savings so with that savings is let me know okay you took this much out in cash then that's where that money was so that way i'm also not swiping my card constantly as well so y'all if y'all don't do nothing else let me cover this because actually y'all sheet um definitely definitely i say invest in some type of um finance book or some type of budgeting book you can get them at the dollar tree and just keep up with your finances especially if you have goals that you're trying to accomplish because by the end of the year i'm trying to touch so much money in my bank account and i'm going to make that happen okay y'all just watch so as i promise there is that um i'm currently filling mine out as you can see up there you know a lot of writing on it. Filling the alpha just this paycheck and you see how much writing on it. Um I have pretty much paid all of my bills except for maybe like three, but those are like automatic payments, so they haven't come out yet. But yeah, so y'all invest, invest, invest in some type of finance sheet to track your finances. Um it's worth it. It's tedious. But it's worth it. So y'all do that. Um, let me know how it works for y'all. Down in the comment bar below. 
And I'm finna wrap this up. And uh, y'all, yeah, I had to turn the camera on, but I'm finna finish my sheet, like my financing sheet. Um, my budgeting sheet, because that's pretty much what it is to me budgeting myself. I'm finna finish it. Then I'm going to write um, a letter to my sister, who's off at basic. Uh, so I can send that off tomorrow. Do a little research, because like I told you, I have really haven't been asleep. So um, I'm going to sleep <laughs> after I finish all of this. I kind of want to watch this movie called The Girl in the Basement that my co-worker was telling me about. Um, so if I don't <laughs> if I don't fall asleep in the meantime, um then we'll do that. So yeah. But for the most part, y'all your girl is doing the thing. I will try to remember to vlog tomorrow. But lately y'all I've been living in the moment, um, enjoying life, like, outside of work when I'm not at work. I try to remember the vlog, and if I remember, I pick up the camera. If I don't, I be feeling bad later because I'm like, dang, I could have vlogged it. Like, I could have really vlogged in my nose pierced. Like, y'all saw my kids get hair pierced, but y'all didn't see me get my pierced, so, Yeah. Um, what else, what else, what else? That's it, y'all. I don't have nothing else to tell y'all. I'm gonna vlog tomorrow, though, before when I'm with Ebony and Jessica. And we, uh, I don't know where this came from. Y'all, that mask, uh, that I wore, it just really did a number on my skin. But anyway, um, let me get off here, because now I'm rambling. So, I will see y'all tomorrow. Um... Y'all have a good night, good day. Whenever y'all watching this, let me know how y'all feeling down in the comment bar below. Don't know if this is going to be a part one or part two. So, just to be on the safe side, we're going to wrap it up. And I'm going to say, I thank y'all for watching. I love y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Um, Stay tuned for the next video. Make sure that you have on your post notifications so you won't miss a post. I'm trying to post every Tuesday and Thursday, y'all. If I don't get that Tuesday, I definitely get that Thursday with some type of content. So, y'all be on the lookout for that. Oh, also, I stopped by Brittany and I picked up my um, makeup palette she bought me from um, Crayon Case. And she got me the MacBook. The matte book. So, I'm going to go and purchase the other ones that I really wanted. And... We're going to play a makeup. It's going to be so exciting. So, yeah. I love y'all. I'll talk to y'all next video.